I'm going to lead you through the design of this product in the next minute. So the first thing that I want to point out are the proportions. If you look at the car from the side, it is a very sleek car. It looks harmonious and natural, uh, but it's uh, a miracle package, so to speak. When you get closer to the car, and I, I step to it now, you're going to see that the car is relatively high. Yeah? So once I'm close to the car, you see it is relatively big. Yeah? So that's the point in having the right proportions that you can create something that really stands out and looks sleek and attractive, but is delivering on functionality quite a bit. Very large wheels, 20 inch, 22 inch wheels. Super aerodynamic design on the wheels and on the whole body. The car features a drag coefficient of 0 0.24. So, this a record breaking drag coefficient. We featured something and I want to, to leap a little bit to the front we featured something that is very important to us to have a very unique unique front end architecture so a horizontal extension and a light bar that leads through the whole front of the car these lights will be animated and this is something that we're going to bring into production all in the space. You can see this is a new logo type. A refreshed, very modern look to it. And clearly readable, especially when it is lit. The architecture on the logo is important yeah, as it connects into the light seamlessly. And we do feature an aerodynamic uh, thing here. So this is like a flying blade. Yeah, the air beam goes through and comes up at the bonnet again. And the same feature we do have on the side. So the air flow is entering here and is delivered into the wheelhouse and is exiting the wheelhouse then. The front is full of sensors. This car is prepared for autonomous driving and will hit the marketplace in 21, 22 here. On the design, we also wanted to, to have a seamless connection to the greenhouse. Yeah, so the black bonnet is seamlessly connected to uh, the greenhouse and aerodynamic uh, features are not over. We have another one here on the back. Uh, the the uh, roof has dropped quite a bit and the airflow is uh, leaving the car uh, under the big wing spoiler on the back. So you have seen on the, on the lower chair there is another uh, DIL that is very important to give the car a very characteristic face and we use our ID honeycomb pattern not only in the lower uh, part of the fascia but also in the light architecture itself and again this all could be animated so let's talk a little bit on the interior Our platform, the MEB, is delivering big time on interior space. So you have a really big, big interior. Super comfortable, four chairs, yeah, uh, all independently uh, maneuverable. So you can uh, make yourself comfortable on each space. The huge touch screen, 15 inch, is able to hold a lot of menus so you can download applications. 
the car is always online and the interior design is also very specific, very clean, very puristic and very nice. On the interior we do have another uh, very important feature that is our augmented reality HUD system. This system is able to project information 50 meters ahead of you into your view of sight or onto the road animated, augmented, so a very unique feature. We have a flying middle console and if you come a little closer you can take a look at this. So a charging device, cup holders, very seamlessly and clean in design. Also the steering wheel is very nicely done and is featuring uh, a touch sensitive operation. The material is something that I would also like to point out. We use uh, a new material here called apple skin that is uh, made out of the remainings of apple juice production. So the recycled product that has a very nice soft touch to it. Feels like leather, but isn't. Okay, so the platform allows a super spacious, luxurious interior space on a very content footprint. Again, awesome portions that we do feature here. So let's take a look at the trunk. Again, very spacious and very big. And there's a little gadget that I don't want to spare. We have two electrically driven skateboards integrated here. And of course, you can store away your charging cables. And you have two helmets there, so you can go on the last mile with the skateboards and they are charged on the car. If you look at the back of the car, we also have an uh, element that you're gonna see on all ID family members, a horizontal light bar, a lid badge on the back, very clean, surfacing, super aerodynamic, and also this uh, light feature is animated. So very nice features that the ID family shares and again this is not a singular product it's one part of a huge family of products that will come to the United States. Okay, any questions? All right, so there you have it, a quick look at the ID Space Vision concept with the gentleman responsible for its creation. A really cool look at the future of electrified Volkswagen. This is an 82 kilowatt hour battery. They're claiming 300 miles of all electric range and a zero to 60 in about five seconds. So let me know in the comment section below what you think and go back to tflcar.com for the latest and greatest in new car reviews.